All right, we've made it to our second Airbnb here in Odessa. Um, this is actually, uh, if you're watching this in the future, this is when the uh, COVID-19 is happening. So we're actually, uh, we're stuck in Ukraine actually. So I'm gonna show you the uh, Airbnb, but I just wanted to mention that we are stuck here. That's why we've gotten another apartment in uh, Odessa. Um, unfortunately, we're, it looks like we're gonna be stuck here for roughly a month. Uh, depending on what uh, happens with the borders here in Europe. But uh, let me show you the apartment. That's the whole reason uh, you're here. So let me stop ranting and uh, we'll get to it. So if you see behind me is the living room area. So pretty um, pretty basic little uh, living room area. There's a, a sofa. I don't think that forms into a bed. I might be wrong about that though. And then it looks like they've got uh, some cable television, satellite television there, uh, which is nice. This is a nice uh, open lit uh, seating area, um, little dining table is always nice, pull over, maybe have some uh, meals there while we eat TV, which probably won't be necessary because we've got the dining table, which I'll get to there shortly. Uh, so yeah, just inside the door, there's a lot of storage space here. And then just in the bathroom is this awesome tub. One of the reasons we booked actually is uh, we, we don't have a tub at our home in Spain. So we're like, oh, let's book a tub because we love soaking our bones and it's cold right now a little bit. It's March, so it's a little chilly, but yeah, just a little vanity here, sink, and a uh, nice big tub. I really like that little lip there, so you can sit there. Uh, toilet, you know, everything's nice and clean. I haven't seen any issues with, um, with uh, sanitation or cleanliness. Uh, heated towel rack that's electric there. Um, I really like that there's a, um, a laundry basket there, too. Usually we end up, like, piling it in the washer or, like, on the floor. But here's the uh, very well lit kitchen dining a uh, area. I really like this dining uh, table here. Um, and you'll see as I pan this way, why? What you got going on here? Um, yeah, just this beautiful view of the Black Sea there. So yeah, uh, under there, there's a uh, washing machine for your laundry. And you see here we have a uh, burner top and a, and a stove. Um, it's always nice to have a hood range, pull all those breakfast and lunch and dinner smells out. Uh, there is a ductless unit. The remote is available to us. Uh, we've had issues in the past when we come to places at certain times, they actually don't leave that uh, AC um, remote available to you, which is frustrating. I think they do it for uh, cost efficiency. They don't want you to use it when it's cool outside, but uh, I love that that is available to us. Decent size fridge there, uh, decent size freezer at the bottom as well. Um, plenty of radiators throughout so far, it seems. Uh, so. That's also nice because it is a bit chillier. Uh, we actually prefer to sleep uh, with the cold air at night and bundled up. But uh, but yeah, you know, if it gets a little chilly during the day, we'll adjust those accordingly. And here's the uh, bedroom. It's actually a very spacious, large bedroom. And the closet blew my mind when I slid the door back because usually the closets are tiny and they're just shelves. But this is an actual walk-in closet here. Look at that. So there's plenty of space here. They've got a few of their... Uh, cleaning supplies. There's the uh, laundry drying rack, um, plenty of extra towels and sheets and pillowcases. It looks like they've got a couple extra pillows and blankets available as well. So that's always nice. Uh, personally, I sleep better with two pillows. So I always really enjoy when I come into a place and there's a couple pillows available. Um, so yeah, I think that's really about it. Let me uh, jump out here on the patio and show me the show you guys the view. Let me leave that door open. I'm going to head out there. So this is really great, actually, this amazing uh, view. It really wraps around us, this sea. And then, so this was a score. We actually were going to head to our the old neighborhood we were just in because we were actually staying in, like, that building uh, on our last day. And there was a grocery store across the street. But we got so lucky. We actually just came back from that market where all those workers are entering. And we were able to get basically everything that we'll need for our stay. And that market's open 24 hours, so that's great. Uh, here's some random uh, airplane. Not sure what's going on with that, but it's a nice green area here. There's a workout area. Um, everything looks really nice. Uh, I think so far it's been really quiet. We've ran into, uh, there's a lot of construction going on right now because I think everyone's trying to get their places open for the spring and everything. But uh, yeah, beautiful apartment so far. Um, I will put the link in the description. Uh, for the unit so you can check prices. I will also include a uh, link that will provide a credit uh, for people who have never used the Airbnb platform before. This will allow them a uh, credit upon sign up and first booking. I will also re receive a credit. Uh, if you are not comfortable using my link and you know somebody who uses Air the Airbnb platform, 
ask them to share their uh, sign up link with you. Uh, this way you and them will receive credit, everyone wins, and uh, you can uh, you know, possibly experience a unit somewhere like this uh, in your neck of the woods, or if you're looking for um, uh, a little vacation after all this uh, COVID stuff clears up. But yeah, check out the platform. Uh, thanks for watching my video and uh, be safe everyone.